Hello everybody and welcome back to episode number nine of Coop Mania Farm. Let's check how we gonna be doing. How you doing? We're doing pretty good because the spirits are in good humor today. I think you'll have a little extra luck. All right, so there is our first coop. Very exciting. So tomorrow we'll be able to buy our first set of chicken. Very, very exciting. Yes. All right, let's go give Egbert some water. All right. Very good. We, we got to do it for Egbert. Yeah. All right. So we got an ancient seed. Still don't know how or, well, don't know where I got it exactly because I never watched the last episode yet. So we got that. Not that it does a whole lot of good, but we do have, uh, at least for this playthrough, I should say, in a normal playthrough, it'd be absolutely fantastic to have an ancient seed this early. But uh, let's see, we can make another bar. We have five for our silo when that is ready. So today, I think we'll do some of a demining because we have 300 wood, 100 stone, for our um you keep that for energy for our next coop so we're good in terms of resources for that so uh yeah let's go check the spring forgeables for some spring onions and then we also need to move the coop down to here because there's going to be far more grass down here for all the chicken friends. All the chicken friends. Yeah. So let's check it out. Down here. And then something else I was thinking about is that um, we're going to need a lot of earth crystals for mayo makers because that's ultimately what's going to limit our production for the days without me having to um stand and basically baby the mayo makers so hopefully we'll be able to have as many mayo makers as we do chickens because the chickens will produce an egg every single day so if we have 36 of them which we're probably gonna have way more now but just saying we have 36 of them we're gonna need at least 36 mail makers that's 36 earth crystals so uh if nothing else we'll definitely be mining <laughs> because we're gonna need it um i was also considering possibly doing the community center but i would feel bad with myself if i um did that just for the crystallarium it feels a little cheesy and honestly it kind of is i know you you play how you want to and well that just makes me feel not not the the, the best i'll say that not the best so I think it'll make it fun in a sort of frustrating way. No, I have not, Linus. I knew. Oh, I knew. <laughs> uh, every time I say it like that, I think of Faulty Towers. Ooh, a leak. Faulty Towers is a uh, British comedy for those not in the new. All right. How far did we make it? Not very far. Okay, level five. Okay. So we are going to need rocks. Ooh, two hits for those. Uh, and definitely, definitely earth crystals. Well, okay. Well, that's good. Uh, let's see. Uh, I think we had, yeah, 10 slimes. Okay, so not that getting into the adventurers guild is of the utmost importance but 
Well, actually, it will because we'll be able to buy better weapons. Better weapons. So now that I uh, uh, think about it a, li a little more in depth there, uh, we will want to uh, ooh, get in the Adventurer's Guild. We leveled up, so we don't have to worry about um, our energy for tomorrow. So we can stay out. Uh, again, don't want to pass out because that'll lose money. And it would it would slow our chicken production. Ah, uh, let's see. Well, let's eat these. Let's see here. Okay, we can eat one more. Yeah, and definitely a backpack upgrade. That is um, definitely going to be something we need as soon as we're able to. All right. Thank you, Miss or Mr. Slime. I appreciate you. All right. Let's see what's in here. Could be an earth crystal. It's absolutely nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Spoiler alert, it's absolutely nothing. Uh, do we want that? Um, uh, no, not really. We're not really going to need an amethyst for anything in this playthrough. So we'll be all right. We'll be all right. Everything going to be all right. There you go. All right. Boop and boop. Just booping the rocks. That's what we don't. Yee. Yeah. Alright, let's see what's over here. Absolutely not. Again. Thought this was supposed to be a good day. What's going on here? Huh? Oops. A few, uh mine the right way all right and then if i remember right we do have a uh nope that was the last floor i was like i i thought there was a ladder up here but i think that was the previous floor yep there it is game's like fine here ah uh, if those could just be earth crystals those would be great Right, got a hug of slimes. There we go. Earth crystal? Nope. One of these days, I might actually be right. And it might actually drop one. I have no idea if I can or not. But you know what? I, I'm going into it with uh, with a positivity of the attitude. -y. There you go. All right. And we will hug you because we still need to get that quest completed. Okay. Well, if you insist. Like, fine, here's the way down. Since you were so nice and gave me a hug. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you would have necessarily thought of it that way, but that's how I'm transcribing it. Oh, so many good things, but... Not what we're looking for. We need earth crystals. Come on. Come on. You have an earth crystal? Do you know where one is? Tell me. Oh. I'm gonna say if you tell me, I may spare your life. I mean, give you an extra hug. Mm-hmm. Oh. <gasps> Earth crystal. Okay, so Duggies, yes, they are something we want to uh, prioritize. Well, since we need the energy, and since we have a lot of these, we will very, very slowly increase our energy. Very slowly. I mean, it's slow, but it works. Oh, and I didn't even get the thing I wanted. Okay, well, oop. Uh, okay, well, boom. There you go. Give me the earth crystal. Thank you. Hey, we got our way down. How many more slimes do we need? Just two more. Well, actually, this floor will do it. Yeah, we have one more than what we need. Do, 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 do. Uh, oop. Enter the Adventurer's Guild. All right, give me the stone. Okay, anything else? No, I don't think there's any more Duggies, right? Nope, no more Duggies. All right. 
So what we can do? Oh, we're gonna get something here, aren't we? All right, we're gonna uh, we're gonna get a femur. Okay, I forgot I remixed the uh, mine reward. So we got a femur, six to eleven damage. I mean, plus two speed. It's a club. Okay, I'll take it. You know what? That actually kind of worked out nice. Oh. <gasps> And so did this two. That's two eight uh two egg makers, two mayo makers. I should say. I got excited. Okay, it's it's a little slower, but you know what? It does a little bit more damage. All right, let's test it out. Boom, boom. All right. Yeah, there you go. That's what you want to do. So if you spam the special move and the normal attack. You can basically just go, go crazy. All right. Uh, come here. There you go. I don't know why I'm doing this. I really don't need the bug meat, but you know, they're like, we're challenging you to a duel. A d -d -d duel. Oh, you know what? Uh, I might have to gracefully retreat because... Oh, nope. Uh, I just noticed my health there. There you go. Okay, I don't really need to fight you guys anymore. So I'm just going to try and search for the... Oh, 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 don't die. Don't die. Oh, well, okay. Well, that's a bad floor. Okay. Well, I'm going to make an executive decision and retreat for a little bit. Because uh, I don't want to die on the uh, easiest floors possible. <laughs> there we go. All right. We entered the Adventures building. The Adventures Guild. Uh, we can buy a wooden blade. Uh, three to seven. Which is still worse than what we got. Okay, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to go home and we're going to work on some of the bars and get them ready because that's the other thing that we're going to need a lot of is copper bars to make said mayo makers. So copper bars and earth crystals. Really, it's going to be earth crystals. Like copper bars will be easy enough to get, um, but... Uh, earth crystals are going to be the sort of challenge without having a crystallarium. I kind of don't want to uh, get a crystallarium just to see, you know, how much I end up regretting that. But uh, yeah, there we go. Okay. I could make another uh, thing as well, but we don't need to worry about it too much. Okay. Since we have some energy let us chop some trees because remember we also don't have to worry about our energy level for tomorrow because we leveled up actually i think we leveled up twice in combat and mining so yeah let's kind of clear this out Oh, there we go. And after this tree, we'll go check, get another uh, copper bar going. There we go. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, boop. Okay. Make sure let's store that in there. Okay, clear these out here. Uh, we could probably do at least two. We could eat the leek and do three if we really wanted to, but um, kind of want to save that for the mines. Oh, look at all the butterflies! So pretty. I love the ones in summer. Those are the those are the the ones I really like because there's like red and blue, and yellow. All right, let's get another one going, and we can do one more. All right, so let's put you away. Oh, nope. Put you away. Let's put... There we go. 
to save that for energy, organize that a bit. And then, um, yeah, we'll just wait for this last bar here. Uh, thank you, Robin, for building our first chicken coop. And then, actually, that'll work out tomorrow. So tomorrow, or next episode, I should say, what we'll do is we will um, go to Robin, move the coop down a bit. Matter of fact, let's check it right now just to make sure there's nothing that's going to be immediately in our way yeah well we'll put it right here so what i might do is just get rid of you guys just to make sure there's absolutely nothing that's going to get in the way and we'll just replant you real quick okay we'll get our last bar boop boop and get that ready for eggbert tomorrow and there's eggbert He's sleeping. Okay, there we go. And before we end the episode, I'd like to leave you with tonight's nugget of love, which comes to us from Second Peter chapter 3, verse 9, which says, The Lord is not slow in keeping his promise, as some understand slowness. Instead, he is patient with you, not wanting anyone to perish, but everyone to come to repentance. There you go. Pray that that blesses you. And with that, I will leave you with Bok Bok.